the show jumps right into the cliffhanger from the previous episode. Kev is seen falling down the building. Carmi, however, comes to his rescue just in time to save him. Carmi and a diminished Kev dodge Dylan following a safe landing. Dylan, however, thinks someone could have been up there on the roof. When he lands to investigate, he finds Carmi's play script on the floor. The scene then switches to Carmi taking Kev home. Kev, after reading many blended comics, requests an onion. Kev returns to his regular self after biting into the onion. The following day, Carmi, who was adopted as an infant, inquires about her biological parents. Her parents then tell her that since Carmi was found abandoned before they adopted her, they have no idea who they are. As a consequence, Carmi starts wondering who her biological parents are. Liana spends time in rehearsals trying to teach Dylan how to be her dance partner. Dylan, however, is preoccupied with Madison. Liana and Dylan end their relationship shortly thereafter. Dylan, however, appears unconcerned. Then, Dylan starts asking everyone if they've misplaced their play, but nobody will admit to having misplaced it. Dylan's suspicions of Carmi intensify because she is the only one who isn't there. Meanwhile, two police officers visit Carmi's home. They hope to make money off of the fact that she is a vampling. Carmi's siblings attempt to protect her, but towards the end they're deceived by the cops, who now know that Carmi lives there. Carmi and Kev seek advice from blended comics writer Octavia. They discover that no matter which side Carmi picks, she will eventually forget about the other one. Moreover, upon further investigation, they discover that Carmi's mother is a vampire and has the potential to influence Carmi into becoming one as well. The episode review in episode 5. Carmi saves Kev. Meanwhile, Dylan is becoming more convinced that Carmi is a vambling. Some of the show's supernatural elements are alluded to here but it fails to pique our interest in any significant manner. The story appears to be progressing painfully slowly, losing momentum as a consequence. The show's characters aren't exactly likable, either. Carmi's fatal flaw is that she tends to treat things too casually. In addition, she approaches most things with a childish demeanor. The current antagonist, Dylan, lacks the charm necessary for this role. That said, the sidekick Kev seems to be a good fit. Overall, the episode doesn't reveal much, but it does leave us with a key piece of information. We'll have to wait and see how things go moving forward. Unfortunately, this episode is not particularly enjoyable. <laughs>